most of us may not wish to have an adaptation movie since some of our favorite animes. But which of them exactly stands out that you could probably say, this one is close enough? Well, here are the top 10 lists of live action movies from Japan that are worth watching. But before we start, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification button for our newest updates. Coming in at number 10, a Bleed of the Immortal. Manji, a samurai that was deceived by his superiors to kill plenty of people causing him to gain a price in his head. Soon after they travel, numerous group of ronin that chasing his bounty block his way, holding his little sister Machi as a hostage. Because of their misunderstanding, Machi was instantly killed that pushed Manji to murder every member of the group. And at his last breath, an old woman suddenly placed his strange worms in his body that caused him to become an immortal. Several years later, a girl named Rina Sano that resembles his little sister is asking for his help, requesting to be her bodyguard and to avenge her father's death. Follow and witness their exciting journey as they seek revenge and get answers on the questions they have been looking for. At number 9, we have Jin Tama, an action comedy drama that you surely laugh out loud. When aliens conquer the entire planet, they banned all people to carry sword in the public, for being feared for the samurai that caused them huge damage from the previous wars. Sakata Jintaki, a highly skilled samurai in feudal Tokyo, established a shop that takes any kind of jobs for a fee. This is where the adventure begins as his team received two different jobs. Elizabeth needs to find Katsura and some swordsmith requests them to look for the dangerous sword called Benizakura, which later revealed that both jobs are connected and there was something more deeper request than they thought. At number 8, Tokyo Ghoul, a world where ghouls secretly live with humans hiding their true identity, as they kill and consume human flesh in order to survive. Ken Kaneki, the main protagonist in the story, encountered a date with a girl named Rize, which she later found out her true form as a ghoul. Thanks to his luck, he was saved by falling still before becoming the next victim leaving Rize dead and both of them sent to a hospital. It turns out Kaneki became a half ghoul half human after performing an organ transplant in his body using Rize's organs. This is where Kaneki's agony begins, wherein he needs to find a way to fight his hunger as a ghoul and to adopt his living in a world where ghouls are not meant to exist. At number 7, Lupin the Third, the most wanted thief in the history of anime. Younger generations may not relate in this kind of live action movie, but for the older ones, this will surely bring back classic memories. The story focuses on a priceless necklace, the Crimson Heart of Cleopatra, wherein Arsenio Lupin the Third forms a team of thieves to steal this precious treasure. With him, here are Daisuke Jigen, a sharpshooter and also a loyal friend of Lupin, Guimon Ishikawa, a reliable samurai who can cut through almost anything, Fujiko Mine, a beautiful and cunning thief who uses her own charisma to deceive and manipulate, she is also Lupin obsession. His team also includes Michael Lee, Lupin's rival that at any time he could betray them. Marvel and laugh at this classic film that you'll definitely be entertained every scene. At the number 6 spot, we have Full Metal Alchemist. To obtain something, equal value must be lost, pertaining to the alchemist's first law of equivalent exchange. 
a journey of two brothers named Edward and Alphonse Elric, trying to find the legendary philosopher's stone that is believed to be able to restore their original bodies. Their life starts to mess at their younger age. When they fail to perform a forbidden alchemy, the human transportation that could resurrect their mother not knowing the consequences, resulting in Edward's losing his left leg and right arm, while his younger brother Alphonse loses everything except his soul, that Edward can only do is to attach it on a suit of armor next to them. Later on, Edward Elric received an invitation to join the military where he earned the title of being the full metal alchemist. At number 5, Parasite, an action horror packed film that contains some brutal scenes. So if you're faint hearted, maybe this movie is not fit for you. This is the story of a high school student Shinichi Izumi, who had a mysterious creature called Parasite in his right hand due to its failed attack that's supposedly to enter and infect his own brain. Although Parasite in this story kill and devour humans to satisfy their starvation, Migi, the parasite in his right hand, opposed on what they're doing. Also, the reason for that is, Migi's life and nutritional needs depends on Shinichi's body, so in order for them to survive, they need to work together to battle these evil parasites that slowly conquering the world by disguising themselves as a human being. At number 4, we have Assassination Classroom, sci-fi fantasy live-action movie which they really did well. Portrait characters and weapons they used are similar on the ones in the anime. You will definitely enjoy watching this show, it is about the mission given to the Class E for the attempt to assassinate their homeroom teacher named Koro Sensei, an extremely powerful octopus like monster that possesses an incredible speed and unmatched superhuman abilities. Koro Sensei's real plan is to destroy the world, governments already tried to stop him, but they just only failed miserably. And his only condition for stopping it is if he can be eliminated by his students before the graduation day. So in your opinion, what would be the different killing methods that they'll do to accomplish this mission? <laughs> Coming in at number 3, the third spot, Bleach. Who doesn't love Bleach anime series? Well, if you're really a fan, this live-action movie they've done is not that bad. Fight scenes and the storylines are really that convincing. To give you a short glimpse of the story, this is about a high school student named Ichigo Kurosaki who has the ability to see ghosts. As one day he came across a battle between Rukia Kuchiki, a soul reaper from the Soul Society, and a Hallow which is an aggressive spirit who devours souls from the living and the dead. On an unlikely occasion, Rukia lent Ichigo his power to defeat the Hallow. Now with Ichigo's power, he will be forced to help suppress the ravaging spirits that are disturbing the world. At number 2 on the second spot, Death Note. One of the best live action movies done by Japan. It already consists of four films that fans will surprisingly enjoy it. The story begins on Light Yagami who intends to change the world using the Death Note, a black notebook on Bear Reaper, which whatever name you write on it will surely end in death. He wants the criminals that escapes the law to pay for their crimes. Although Light has good intentions to eliminate crime, it still makes no difference because he also kills people. So soon, law enforcement will conduct an operation to pursue and catch light. And this is where a famous detective named L enters the scene. <laughs> and for our top list, at number 1, Rurouni Kenshin, a legendary samurai better known as Hitokiri Barasai, 
who is a former assassin that killed thousands of people in a battlefield. As time passes by, Himura Kenshin's principle also had changed. Currently, he now wanders on the streets carrying a reverse blade katana, giving aid and protection for the oppressed and for the ones in need to somehow repay for the sins he has committed in the past. This adaptation movie already had three parts that are really impressive. Five scenes are excellent, scenery are stunning, and even the resemblance of the characters are convincing. So don't miss this adventure live action film which will surely be included in your favorite list. <laughs> So that's it for today's list. Leave a like if you enjoy our video and don't forget to subscribe to be updated for more upcoming top 10 videos. See ya!